ladies and gentlemen from the Philippines, Pinaka Mangalin, numero uno, the magician, Efran Bata Raya. Hello, I'm Pang Bata from America. Gini ba, Efran Bata, 1995 World Eight World Championship. Trying to get position on this ball in the corner pocket. He's perfect on the shot. Stop the people right there. Wonderful. I would say so in this frame. He made it. Well, he got that good position, didn't he? Worked it around. Like number one in this uh, eight ball championship tournament. Big item for Martin. Semi-final, FN Battle Reyes versus Mark Jervis, 1995 World 8 World Championship, semi-final, race 8 po ito, mga kaminalista. Rap 1, FN break, bata ka lang dito, winner breaks. And he is really at the top of his game. He won the last two out of three turns. That's what's on your birth certificate, huh? I met him in 1985. He came to Texas under the name of Cesar Morales. <laughs> Nobody had ever seen of him, no one on there. It wasn't, wasn't long after that they said, hey, wait a minute, there is no Cesar Morales. Right. His real name but is... But by any Efren name, Reyes. he is still a great player. Jarvis has been pocketed on the break, has the opening chance at a run. He's going for the striped balls. Jim Rempe, how's and, he doing? And he's playing very well. He's, he can either shoot this ball, which he's not going to. He's going to shoot this ball, this corner, this side pocket. To my uneducated eye, he apparently has no problems, has no pocket Want that are cluttered up. The solids are up there in the far left-hand corner, but he's not concerned about that. Looks like the table is pretty well set up. I think he might have wound up. He would have liked to have gotten straight in at 12, but the, no problem here. He's got a nice pace. I mean, he's moving around the table. It would not only be a very important win for him should he beat Reyes to advance to the finals, but it would be interesting because he would end up weak. Archer. Jeff Carter. Oh, excuse me, Carter. Mark Jarvis. Great. By Tomaso Cabalas. Mark. Boy, that was close, was it not? He got one in the corner. He made a couple balls. Yeah. Side pocket. Maybe we're just a little bit jaded, but um, after to go all the time. Well, he's shooting the 14 ball on the side pocket. So here. Pulling, uh, ball go up straight up the table. Pindi ni Mark Jarvis ng USA sa rat number two. Position for this ball here. And did it beautifully. Yeah. Why not? Jarvis trying to get an early advantage on Reyes, and from the way Reyes can. Yeah, he's playing the nine ball here in the corner pocket, playing the cue ball back out here. Trying to get position on this ball in the corner pocket. He's perfect on the shot. Let's stop. See Jarvis can follow the plan. Stop the cue right there. You want to put a little Smith, bit. He's the referee and the man in charge of the match. More puck. Oh, he's giving himself a touch. Mark Jarvis, a oh, moose of ball. This is all lost. Some piece of laban. I would say so in this. Two zero score. He made it. So Jarvis has taken a quick 2 0. Punta na tayo sa Rock 3. Mark and Break. The long Rock na ang kalamangan ni Mark Jarvis. May pumasok na bola sa Break of Jarvis. Is there an 8 ball? Second ball. Now, if you really want to get action on the 8 ball and get it rolling, you got to hit the second ball. Perhaps sometimes you don't get as well break as hitting the head ball, but it gets the eight moving. Look what he did here. He shot the wrong ball. He had a perfect opportunity and just gave it away. He shot the wrong ball. I can't believe he did that. And Reyes is shooting the solid balls now. Two balls here that are tied up. Oh. And he's going to go for them. No, he's on the solid balls. Yes. He doesn't even have to bother with it. No. It looks wide open to me. He's got but one ball down the corner that he played position on. Let's see what Rowdy uses. Oh, that was a great shot. He 
You know, shooting the wrong ball there. It's the Vikings years ago that ran for a touchdown the wrong way. <laughs> That's right. Was the Jim Marshall? Wasn't he the guy? <laughs> yeah, I uh, believe so. They did him around it the wrong way. Yeah, Ro Floyd Regal did 40 years prior to that. Yeah, it happens. He turned around. Draw the cue ball loose for the eight to side. Every battle, yes, one and score. Salaban ato. Have him throw a game away, in essence. Yeah. Oh. So, everybody makes mistakes. That's why they put erasers on pencils, sir. Two and one score. Four. F and break. He hit the second ball too, but he hit it from the opposite side of the rack. The mark is now saying, "What can I shoot? What what am I entitled to go after? Let's not make the same mistake twice." What would you pick? As you look at the tip. Well, that's what he selected to do. Yeah, he's going with the solids. Yes. So solid, I'm pinning in Mark Jarvis. Rat number four. He's off and running. He's playing good, Tommy. He feels uh, as though a lot of the credit goes to his good friend Mike Thomas. Well, I've been talking with him a lot lately and giving him a good attitude and a good desire here to play and get up and try your heart out and dedicate yourself to the game of pocket billiards. It's the only way you can be a winner. Seven first. Well, the five is out in the clear. It has pockets that can be pocketed in, but the four ball, it looks like. And then, of course, stop it right there and put the eight. He's come too far. Mm. He's come too far. Now he's in big trouble. He has no he's shot at that. Of, um, really, I guess not. Huh? No, not when an opponent has uh, six, seven balls on the table. To play safe to where Efren doesn't have a shot at any ball is almost. He's going the other way. He does have a pocket coming across the table this way. Oh, oh, close. Oh, what a great effort. Oh, A for effort. And the crowd gives him a nice round of applause. What a well thought out. Two games apiece. First one to eight wins it, moves to the title. To the championship go against uh, Carter. Sure, no. Balls are wide open. Played for the 14 ball in the side pocket. Jimmy, did you ever ask? I wish he would go back, and I don't care if it's as <laughs> Caesar or Efren. He has invaded America, Tom. I'm telling you, some help. <laughs> you don't care what name he puts on the passport. Let huh? <laughs> me tell you, he has something else. Efren Reyes. 13 ball, 15 in the same pocket. And nothing left to do, but he can, either, even. he can either play for the eight in the side or the corner. He has a lot of options here. Perfect. Efren Battle Reyes, Itatablang scores. Sa two all. He is not out of this match. I know the score is only two to two, but I want to tell you something. He truthfully believes five that he's going to So, we'll find out. Well, no balls. He gets to go to the table. Go. The way Mark Jervis, USA. He's cutting the six in the side pocket. Good shot. Let the cue ball loose a little bit. Let's see what happens. Solid. Mm. Uh, it's going to be rough for him. It's a rock number five. Oh, what a nice shot. Well, he's going, he's going all out. Yeah, and he got that cue Make the seven. Maybe he can make the seven. I think he can make it. So well, if he can make the seven, then it's... Well, that is... He's got a pocket, I think. He's plotting some strategy right here to like. where he perhaps will save... Uh, no, I was going to say he's maybe thinking about saving the bank. He's going to make the one ball and knock the eight off of the cushion, try to play position in the Ooh. seven. No, he missed the eight ball. Just brushed it. No, he's in trouble. Jimmy Matias says he's very good at it. Was that a good hit? Yes. Oh, baby. So says Scotty. Yes. Good hit, Scotty says. Almost going to play position to bank this eight cross sides. No, he's not. He's going into the eight. Oh, Moved okay. it a little bit. And now what? Depending upon how hard he hits it. He's going to hit this with low left-hand English. That's it, baby. Yeah. Yeah. What a shot. What a shot. What a way to win. That game, he takes a three-game to two-game.
Nabang na naman ang isang rock si Mark Gervitz. Punta na tayo sa rock. Six. Mark Gervitz on break. Walang pumasok sa break ni Mark. FN Battle Reyes. Eight. Yeah, he wants this. He's playing the one ball. He's shooting the long one. And great position. Solid. Ang pili ni FN. He's got to move the four ball. He's a rock six. He's coming a little bit long, I think. He's coming a little bit long. It's going to have to wait. He's got plenty of balls to play position on that ball with. One thing I like about watching the Philippine players, Tom, is the American players. If you notice Efren's stroke, how wavy it is and how much wrist action he uses compared to the American players. Completely different types of Efren Reyes. I think that's one of the things that makes him such a good player. He's really good at the concentration. Well, he got that good position, didn't he? Worked it around. He controls the cue ball as well as anybody that I've ever seen. And the crowd was considered as good as anybody in the world and ranked number one in this... Uh, Eight ball championship tournament. If Jarvis were to beat him, it would update the obvious be a big, big item for Mark. Efren Battle Reyes, muling itatablang scores, three all. I think I could make this. So the match remains. So punta na tayo sa rock seven. Efren on break. Ball on the side, made a solid ball. Hit the seven ball from number seven. In the endeavor of this kind, you got to have a little of that, don't you? Well, when they asked me, hey, uh, well, Jimmy, what's uh, what's it take to be a professional pool player and to be a champion? I said it's very simple: of an eagle, the touch of a surgeon, the heart of a lion, and what else, Jimmy? The three D's: dedication, <laughs> determination, and desire. Think a little luck in there as well. That, of course, Branch Ricky said that luck's the residue of hard work. So I know what you're talking about. He's going to hit this soft, I think. No, oh, he got position on the two. Yeah. But he might shoot the three first. Have to, uh, have to shoot the two ball. Hmm. Efren's a type of player that uh, you never really quite know what he's going to do. Too much of a chance. He could shoot the six and come back up this way and try to get... That's what he's doing. No, he tried to hit the eight ball and he mm -hmm. missed the eight. He missed it and he may not have a shot at the three. And after his credentials here, or he's liable to leave the table wide open for Jarvis. Oh, he may get it. Oh, I thought he might get a kiss off that thing and still get it. <laughs> yeah, but which would that be, Jimmy? It would be the 15 in the side. <laughs> <All right. laughs> 13 all, in the side. I'm all through setting you guys up. Forget it. The all easy the table, and then come down and take care of the bottom of the table. And the eight ball is down there. It'd be a great place to finish now, wouldn't it? Right. So you try to clear one section of the table at a uh -huh. time much that's what can get you in trouble is when you got to move the cue ball around a lot he's bumping balls though you can't mm -hmm. be doing that kind of stuff mm -hmm. four or five balls on the table and your opponent's only got one if you do happen position you have uh, so many ways to play safe you know, he went for the shot yes he know, did he I tried would've... to cut it in the corner and he did oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. i didn't expect that of course he left Efren with a long bank on a three ball even if he missed it but uh... yeah but you know, Reyes can make a long bank. Yeah, exactly. A safety on that shot. Wouldn't so you, would I. Yeah. There was no question about a safety there. Everybody in the room. Maybe himself. Too. So Mark Jervis, muling lalamang ng isang rock kay yes. FN Battle Reyes. Win, that's all. See, I kind of panic over things like that. You guys take it. All three. Punta na tayo sa rock 12. Mark on break. Wins it. 6-5 ang score. Lamang pa rin ng isang rock si Mark Jervis. Another ball. Somebody throw a little money on the end of the table and let's get after it. Boy, this would be a big uh, rack, though. All you gotta do is connect the dots right now. <laughs> I mean, watch, watch how he doesn't move the cue ball around much here, uh, Tom. He won't move around very much at all. He'll just pick them off one at a time. Cue ball not going too far. That eight ball is set right in the middle, too, when he gets it done with that. Yeah. The last two solids on. And, you know, for the novices out there, myself included, I noticed he looked down to check that eight ball over in that pocket, but it was clear, didn't he? Yeah. He wanted to see if it would pass the yeah. nine ball. Yeah. You got to be a shot or two ahead of yourself, no matter. Oh, yeah. Oops. No, he's oh, okay. That's where he wanted it. Yeah. Up in the left hand corner. 
to take a two-game advantage. Wow. You know, Jarvis doesn't waste any time, guys. He just bangs him around when he gets an opening. Scotty puts that Seven five down score. Nasahil Nasi a mark. Race 13. Mark on break. May pumasok na bola. Sayang break. Well, does Mark know the right one to shoot? Well, I don't know. I guess he does. He's he's still on the winner's side. Oh, kalat na kalat ang mga bola. I mean, you can go any which way. I guess he played eight ball right in the middle of the table. So he's stripe and pinili ni Mark Jervis. Mukang tatapusin ang laban dito. Well, considered among the best in the world. What a win this would be for Jarvis. This way for the 15. Yeah, but can he reach it, Jimmy? Yeah, he can get there. He's okay. Well, Ooh, now he isn't. But now, can he get between the 8 and the 6? Looks like he's got Or the corner pocket or the other side pocket. The biggest shot of the uh, tournament for him, of course. Oh. Very risky ang tira na yun. That was a bad mistake there. Kaya madali itong si Mark Jervis. Eppen Bata Reyes. Well, he's left Reyes a chance to run the table now and to narrow the gap again. Remember, he led seven games to five. This will make it 7-6 unless Reyes comes up with a... It's tough enough to beat a guy like Reyes. And when you do get him on the ropes to let him go like this, now it's going to be even more difficult. He might never even come back to the table. Well, you know, you're right. I just noticed that. Waves in it, the way it, huh? Yeah, it's very, very <laughs> wavy <laughs> stroke. Very wavy <laughs> stroke. Football. Long bridge. I think he was catching it between his lunge and his sway, huh? Eprin Bata Reyes. Yeah, one side, eight, and the opposite side. Tatapesin ang kalamangan ni Mark Jervis ng sang rock. Well, as the tension mounts. Indeed. Going to 7-6. It was obvious he was going to make the ball or try to make it in that side pocket. Rock 40 na tayo. Efren on break. Hindi pa po tapos ang laban, mga kabilyarista. Humahabol po itong sa Efren Battle Reyes, the magician. Wala pong pumasok sa break ni Efren. Medyo may dikit-dikit na bola dito. Kailangang gumamit ng diskarte itong si Mark Jervis para manalo. So, Rock na to at uh, sungkit uh, ang semifinal at siyang nalaban sa final. How much did you say this table cost, Tom? $56,000. Three of them in existence. It takes about six months. It's uh, mahogany and it is from Honduras and hand carved. And right now, there's no shot, so you know he's playing a safety here. But you know, every time he's done that, it's come up wrong for him. Well, he tried to make that ball, but yes. if he made it, uh, who knows? A very confusing situation. He's played a safe up the six ball. Whether you have stripes or solids, this is where we go into safety play. You're not worried right now to let you go clustered up. Mm -hmm. For the people that aren't aware, well in hand, and the opponent can put it anywhere in the table he wants. Huh? Exactly. He's going for a tough one here. Good oh, shot. Amen. Did he open him up enough? Uh, well, he's got 14 ball and play position on the 15 ball. This ball down here. He played long position. You know as well as I do, the, the pool gods are watching right now. They're going to send this game into sudden death, one game, yeah. you know it. So. Well, here's a shot. Now, here, this is a good shot here. <laughs> Mattia, I love you. You mean to say, I just Jeff? don't think it's going to happen. Well, if he makes this ball and uses a lot of left-hand spin in this shot, he got a shot. Oh, boy. If he makes this shot, Tom, he wins the match because the position is going to be in the seven. If he does that, he's coming back over here because he can't hit it soft enough, and then he's coming down in here. Well, how good do you have to be just to catch ball and... You see the angle? See where it's coming now? Oh, boy. And that's what came mm -hmm. That's the pool, guys. They're up yeah, there they watching. Are. What do they care about the pain and the frustration? <laughs> what do they care? That's two games in a row, Jimmy. That will be uh, tied at seven games apiece as you look at uh, Mr. Mark Jarvis. 
Looks like Efren's just waiting for Mark to make it. He's given Mark plenty of opportunities, I know that. See, he's going to leave the four ball for his key ball. He's going to play the four. Sometimes you have to think backwards in, in playing eight ball. You think where the eight is, what ball you need to get to the eight ball, what ball you need to get to that ball to get to the eight ball, and so on down the line. So here he's going to use the four for the last shot. And it's a natural position for the eight. Mistake, and you sure end up paying for it, don't you? Everyone but the Reyes. You gotta like the breaker in the next game. Got your wing guy. Heel, heel, Mats. Papunta na rin sa heel. Well, it's tied at seven games apiece. There's Jarvis. How do the golf guys? Seven all on the score, Efron breaks, rock 15, the last rock of the match. Walang pumasok sa break ni Efron. Here's another opportunity. Mark Jarvis. He's selecting the solid yeah. color balls. Pinili ang solid. Dito sa rock 15. He's got a tough shot already. He's got a, he can come right across the table for the five if he wanted to. And he's got the six, I know. Got the five. And now he's gone. Hmm. He has destroyed himself this match, Jimmy. Yeah. Unless he can bank the three ball. Can he cut it back and cut this ball? Gonna try. Oh, look at this shot. <laughs> How about one for the announcer? How about one for the announcer? Right. Huh? You're up one inches. He up left in that 40 seconds, 45 second shot clock. <laughs> he's still playing. I think he's going for a bank shot. He did it. Pasok. But he didn't give himself anything with the six ball, did he? Nothing. Park. Problemas in preparation. Napatawan lang sa Efren Battle Reyes. Imaginable shot and some that no one can think of. That's the shot. He's made more big time pressure shots in the last minute and a half than he's made in his entire pro. This is the one with all the pressure. This is the winning shot. Oh, oh. Sino ba yun na ni Mark Jervis? Medyo magapal ang tira. Efren Damagusian. Mark Jarvis. A gallant battle and an unbelievable try. He has left one of the best players in the world. Uh, an easy wreck. Yeah. And a win into the championship of the World 8 Ball. Anything can happen, though. Nothing's, I mean, Efren is uh, looking at an easy rack right now. I'm sure they'll do whatever they can to make things difficult for him. Oh, they point out to have dinner. They never sleep. The pool gods went out there. No, no, huh? no. It ain't over till the fat mama sings. Golf gods are the ones that never sleep. Pool gods walk away. They've had enough. <laughs> oh. To not get any oh. kind of a shot to yeah. where he could do something with that six ball, that's just a shame. Yeah. But that's the game of pool. And when you think of the great <laughs> he made to get to that one spot and then come up dead empty. He's going to play position for the 14 ball. Reyes just uh, down seven games to five, has come back now, leveled at seven and away from moving on to the eight ball championship against Jeff Carter. Efren Battle Reyes. Winning for the eighth ball. It's unfortunate. Somebody always has to win. Somebody has to lose. Winner for Sia Efren. Pasok to Sean. Foul! Game two. The final. Final highlights. 1995 World 8 World Championship. Efren Battle Reyes versus uh, Jeff Carter. Isa na naman pong matinding uh, tirador ng Amerika. Makakalaban ng Efren dito. Final na po tayo. Race 8 ulit. 
Alice Abre. I see scratching. Jeff Carter, Rock One. We saw him in the semis, and he made the eight ball twice. Unprecedented. Gonna get nothing. Oh, I thought he had a striper headed for the side pocket. Patakaran nila man dito, mga kabilista. Wayne Al breaks. It kind of made it an easy one, eight to four. He's going for the strike. See, right here, he needs to break these balls out as soon as he... A strike from Bailey Nia Jeff Carter. Dito sa rock number one. Uh, not have a shot after that. Well, yeah, that's the problem, Jim. Uh, see if he breaks the cluster up with, with that. My problem up dito. Magkadikit po ang bola 5 at bola 9. 15,000 po ang mapapanalunan ng champion sa match na to at uh, tournament na to. Second ay uh, 7,500. So napakalaki pong pera po ito mga kabilyarista. 1995. Well, made that easily. Nice position. Well, the right way to break this shot up would be off the 12 ball on the cushion there because if you come across the table, no matter where you hit them balls, you're still going to have a shot on the floor. I think he's going to play position on the 12 ball here. Try to get in the middle of the table. Well, a little bit too hard. He can't make the 12 from there, but he's got the 14. It's 14. He's looking at the bank shot. His parents gave him a fiberglass cue ordered out of a catalog for Christmas, Tom. <laughs> and who would ever think? Championship of the world. And that fiberglass uh, stick has suddenly become an ecological marvel now. It is, when he tells you about it, it's uh, as pure as the driven snow. Now we see Efren Reyes, considered among the best in the world. 8-7 semifinal win over Mark Jarvis, and what a thrilling semi-final encounter that was. He's walked into a nice table here for his opening shot. The balls are all loosened up. He's probably going to play for the five ball his next shot up in the corner. Yep, roll the cue ball down, straight in on a five in the corner. As, as uh, Afton Reyes is, you'd have to consider him very fortunate, right, Jimmy, to be playing in the finals tonight because that match belonged to Mark Jarvis a number of times. Yeah. Well, that's for sure. I mean, he really didn't play up to his standard in uh, play. And yet, uh, you know, just for a bit of luck, why Jarvis would be playing here tonight? Like he didn't have. Yes, he did. <laughs> yeah. All guns blazing. And what a great attitude he had after the semifinal competition, even in defeat. Draw the cue ball straight back. Playing the seven ball down the bottom pocket. Oop, he didn't draw it as far as he would have liked to. Cut it down the corner pocket and just run into the, the 12 ball that's on the cushion or the 10 ball. Like that. Correct. Uh, Inamit it. pa yung uh, strike ball. Efren Battle Reyes. Eight balls. Win the first game. No problemos. One zero and score. All right. Rat to tayo. Efren on break. May pumasok na bola sa break ni Efren. Kinaliwa pa ni Magician. No better way to win. Nope. You know, he shot that ball left-handed. Isn't it nice to have that kind of talent, huh? She... Interesting guy, Reyes. Caesar. Caesar Morales. Caesar Morales. Why he changed his name, I don't know. Maybe there's a uh, a passport story in there or not. But he came over and just destroyed most of the good American. I was there. I you were one of the guys? Uh, no, I didn't play in the tournament, oh. but I was there and I saw it. And uh, he did away with all of America's best. Well, he's out here, I think. So it would appear that he's um, on his way to a 2 0 lead. He's drawn. He's going straight into the nine ball left himself an angle on the nine to go two cushions for the eight ball on the side. No, wrong again. Well, he still has got the other pocket. I'm going to put that side pocket across the table. Oops. So he knocks it in. Lamang na po ng dalawang rock sa Efren. Punta na tayo sa rock three. Efren on break. I don't think he made a ball, did he? Nope. 
Well, it may not against a guy that most people consider to be the best in the tournament. And I would think psychologically, uh, Jimmy, that uh, he, he knows he can't make a mistake if this guy's going to take the game away from him. The thing is, I just hope I play well. I've been playing well all week, and I'm not going to feel bad if I lose as long as I play a good match. Mm -hmm. and, and that's a good attitude. And he cut that ball in nicely. How about position shot on the nine ball? He has to cut it back in the corner pocket. Uh, it's too tough. Is he the original results of a misspent youth? Is that the guy <laughs> they coined that phrase about? I thought it was me. This is the world championships. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. No. He's banking this ball. Oh. In a rim rattler. Oh, what a tough break. What a tough break. Get too hard, was it? All balls bank differently. You got to get used to the table to understand the, the banks and have the feel of it. So here's Reyes back at work now, leading two games to none. Go for the solids. He's going to try to break that ball right out in the open a moment ago with a very nice uh, move by the cue ball. Great, great. Efren Bata Reyes for his third win. And just that easily, he has taken a big 3-0 advantage over Jeff Carter in the race. He will slip away. He yes. needs to win this. Alam mo na po ng tatlong uh, rock sa Efren Bata Reyes. Punta na tayo sa rock 4. Efren break. May humabo na bola. Pumasok. Solid ball sa break ni Efren. Just uh, trailing three, nothing, Tom. Well, we got a long way to go, though. It's not yes, over with yet. No. Things have drastically turned around from time to time in this game. The two champions sitting with me know that full well. But I tell you, Reyes is just uh, not making any. By winning the first three games, that takes a tremendous amount of pressure off. Him. Take that edge off himself. If he falls behind four, nothing, five, nothing, he's in serious trouble. He's coming down for the two balls right now. Cue ball got away from him. Mm. Yes, I guess uh, Carter's sitting over there thinking, get ready and do something when you get this chance. Just going to play a little safety here. Good shot. Uh -huh. That's a good shot. Unless he can see this, he's got to make some shots and get some confidence back here and get himself back into looks, this game. Looks like he's playing the 11 ball in the side pocket. Small hole there, isn't there? Mm. Is there one there? Good boy. Perfect. My goodness. Perfect. Well, like I said before, I like the way Jeffrey takes these balls off the tables, I and mean, he's got good knowledge about the game. He's a guy every day who takes the game very, very seriously. Desperately needs to win this game. Trailing 3 nothing, And then have a shot in a 15 ball. I guess he wants it right in the middle of the table, doesn't he? Right, right around where the, the six are right now. Uh-huh. See, nice and soft. He's going to follow this and then play the 15 in the side. But he is following you. Yeah, he's going to keep all high. Mm-hmm. Just as my experts predicted. If he shoots it in the corner, he, he disturbs the six ball. He just wants them slow pinch this ball with a low scratch on this too on the side no i don't think no. so right. so he, he rolled it oh. he rolled oh oh oh, oh. oh. Mm. this there 
<clears throat> well, I think if you shot the ball in and keep the cue ball right around there, I think you would have been better off than rolling it. When you roll a ball like that, you take it light in your hands, they say. You don't know what's going to happen. So we make it a 4-0 advantage. What will we do with this one? He didn't. He's, <laughs> he's come up very short. Here's what he does extremely well, though. I mean, he can hit this ball with low right, like a really spin ball. That's what he's doing, I think. Killing the ball. Oh, wow. Efren Bata Reyes going for his uh, fourth street win in this match. Just like that. So Carter's had some up. Does a nice job racking him up, doesn't he? Hmm? He's the best referee we've ever had. Rock five Matayo, Efren and Ray. Reyes has got at least one in the side pocket. I didn't see what it was. I believe he's got compared to the American players. I think the American players would have rifled the five in with a lot more speed and took the chances with where the cue ball lays. But Efren has that delicate stroke, and he does it as also well. And laid the cue ball just dead in line with the eight ball and made it a relatively easy shot into the corner. Four nothing chair over there, and he's playing the combination here. Yeah. He's not going to get up and go anywhere until Efren misses. Unless maybe he throws a tomato at Efren or something. Just the great Efren Reyes. They have many, many great players. I've yet to see a weak player come from the Philippines. One begins to wonder how many champions do they have over there. No matter what name they come over here under. Oh. <laughs> And Reyes is the first one to admit that he didn't make a very good shot. For this table, otherwise we could be looking at a blowout tonight. Well, this is a nice opportunity to step into. I mean, the balls are really wide open this time. Well, let's watch Carter and hope that he can get off this uh, Schneim to none. First man to get to eight wins it. And that would be the 1995 World Eighth Ball Championship. We're here at the Riviera Hotel and Casino. Jim Matai to Tom Kelly. There's so many ways for him to clear these balls off the table right now. You always want to get the balls on the rail off the table as quick as you can. Those can be a problem, not because only the difficulty of making them, but trying to control your cue ball. It's very difficult when you shoot balls down the rail. Mm -hmm. Going with 14 up in the other corner up there, is that exactly? Right? Yeah. Thirteen will be next. All right. <coughs> and then he's got the and the eight ball dead in the middle and near the side pocket there. Carter trying to get right up off the floor and get back into this match. Not easy. Reyes gave him an opportunity. That's nice. See nothing but champions. We've got Mike LeBron, Kim Davenport, Johnny Archer, Nick Varner. We've even got a blast from the man that I uh, <laughs> defeated for the world title back in 1972. He's over there in the front row. <laughs> you must have been just a child prodigy in 72, Matthias. I was a baby. <laughs> is all right Carter gets a nice warm round of applause 4-1 ang score tatlong rock pa rin ang kalamangan ng Efren Bata Reyes punta na tayo sa rock 6 Carter and break on one of these things all you got to do is put a new cloth on it every once in a while and that's not very often either and this buddy can break ni Jeff Carter ng USA Efren Bata Reyes bumalik sa table Solid ball for the magician. Here is a rock six. Break the five ball up with is the is the one ball. See, I think that's what he's going for right now. Play position right in above here with the one ball. No. Gonna draw this back a little bit to get. That's beautiful, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's gonna break it up right now. Well, he could even make it, couldn't he? Well, I don't think he can make the five. You don't think he'd be, no, he wouldn't come off that hand ball there? No. See, he's looking no. at the two ball. He could have a position on the two ball in the side pocket next to him. Almost made the five, but he got that busted up on the side. 
Eight ball right in the middle of the table. Three balls over against the rail. Not quite against the rail. Efren Reyes, among the best. Go straight across the table for the three up the corner. Great shot. The two goes back to the corner. As far as I'm concerned, this guy ranks up with uh, the greatest players of all time. That uh, we've ever Crane, Ralph Greenleaf. I mean, you can go on and on and on. Those are the players from yesterday, not to mention the players from today. This guy is as good as anybody I've ever seen. Any right, particular game, he plays them all. Billiards, like Willie Hoppy used to play a lot of billiards and played it great, but Willie Hoppy never played the before. Eight ball in the corner, says Reyes, and it is indeed, and he has an advantage now of five games to one. But the only time you know that he's uh, feared Philippines. 5-1 on score. Punta na tayo sa Rock 7. Efren on break. Tatlo na lang kailangan na Efren Battle Reyes. Kamit. Ang world champion. Sa 1995 8 ball championship. World 8 ball. When he's not practicing pool. So, uh, stripe ang pinili ni Efren para sa rock number 7. These beautiful showgirls, my concentration drifted away tremendously. It certainly didn't affect him and his game. I've had a tough time concentrating and it didn't bother him at all. Now there's Lisa Kay. That is Leonard Bloodworth's daughter. Leonard Bloodworth, one of the premier cue makers and is our equipment coordinator as well. Claims the title. Carter sits and watches as you and I do. Shooting that one left-handed. But of course, hope springs eternal for Carter, and uh, anything can happen as long as Reyes doesn't have eight games so far by Carter's. Efren Battle Reyes. Eight ball. Eight ball. He's getting in his groove. Six one on score. Six one now, Reyes. Crowd really appreciating the fine challenge of this uh, native week. Umuusok po itong siya. Dalay dyan, Efren Battle Reyes, mga kabigarista. Rock 8 na tayo. Efren Reyes on break. Limang rock na ang kalamangan ng magician. Halos hindi patirahin na ang kalaban na si Jeff Carter ng Amerika. Stripe para kay Efren Battle Reyes dito sa Rock 8. I shouldn't imagine that a word is good. He can no. use either one of those balls that are down there. The 10 or the 9, didn't Yeah. He's got the 8 ball. Down toward that end of the table. The shot after this next one here will be... No, it could be the 10, too. He can play for the 10. He can play for either ball here. Can we talk a moment about the frustration? You're frustrated right now. I mean, it's been the Efren Reyes show from the beginning. Frustration sets in when you have opportunities to win games in the semifinal match and didn't get the job done. Efren Reyes is very fortunate to be playing for the world championship tonight. It should have been Efren Reyes going, going on shooting, and the, the heel. Yeah. You don't have anything to feel bad about. You just have to sit back and marvel at it all. And wasn't that magnificent to pull? He had that cue ball back in perfect so position. So 7-1 nang score. Nasa heel na po sa Efren Bata Reyes. Punta na tayo sa rock number 9. Jarvis could have won it and didn't. Evan Reyes on break. Well, here's his chance. Well, a slim one to be sure. Pumasok. But alive, but Some break in Evan. Carter's not the type of guy to give up. And just because the game is 7-1, uh, to one, not in his favor, he's not going to give up. He's going to try to make every... of the Pro Tour, and he makes a great cue stick. Playing position on the third, the 11 ball. Anyway, he's going to try to get rid of the 10 ball, or not the 10 ball, the 12 ball next. I'll tell you, every tournament I've been to lately, just as a spectator, it seems to be lately, the Filipinos, uh, you know, first, second, third, or fourth, they're going to force me to come out of retirement in my country here. <laughs> Patriotic Mataya comes back. Well, they're tough. There's no question about that. Yeah. And this and that. Oh, yeah. that lucky stiff. Yeah. 
You never hear a peep out of these guys. They just get up and do their thing, and if they win, they win. If they lose, they lose. They always shake your hand. They're... Well, Carter's got a pretty good chance here to get game number two. He can draw the cue ball up on this one, bump the three, or just stay right there and then cut the 12 in. Straight, it looks like to me. Uh, he got there. Mm, yeah. In the corner. Carter trying to climb back into this. He trails 7-1. 7-2 now. And the crowd gives him a very warm So, nakadalawa na ng score si uh, Jeff Carter. Rock 10 na tayo. Jeff Carter on break. 7-2 ang score. Isa na lang para kay Magician na Prem Battle Reyes. Walang pumasok sa break ni Jeff Carter. Looks like a strike. He's going to play the 12 ball in the corner pocket. Oh, strike ang pinili na Efren dito sa Rock 10. Tatapusin na ba ni Magician? He's looking to get the... He has played magnificent pool. Unbelievably good stuff. Look out. Ooh. He played position on the 15 ball. I don't know if he'll still shoot it or not. Uh... Oh. Well, he's human. That's one of the... Um... Well, oh, I tell you, he wouldn't have had a shot anyway if he'd have made that ball. All these solids all lined up and ready to go. Does he not? No, they're all lined up perfect here. Yeah. Could be a nice big turnaround for him. Let me see if I can set this pattern. That's it. Scott, go out and rack him. We got that one figured out. This one's put it in Carter's column. No, he went up table right away. Ooh, one's going to take the one ball now. Three ball here. Not in a bad spot, though. I mean, if he... Three he's going to one ball. Now he's got the two and the four up there. Is that correct? Up in the corner? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then the five. Well, it's the four, two, three, and then the five. Okay. Looks to me he'll come underneath the five ball and get position on the three ball. A lot of making up to do. He can't afford to make a mistake. And this is a big opportunity for him to win the third game to narrow the gap a bit. Five... Will he shoot the five in the corner or down in there? And then the three in the corner down here, Jim. Three in the corner, just draw the cue ball below it. All right, beautifully done by Carter. That's where he's called it. Jeff Carter, para sa kanyang uh, pangatlong panalo sa la match na to. Di pa po tapos ang laban, mga kabilyarista. He's done it. Game number three, seven to three now. He's still alive. They're pumping oxygen to him, but he's... That happens to be true. Be nice to make the eight in the... 11. Jeff Carter on break. Ay, pumasok na bola sa break ni Jeff Carter. I think he made a solid, didn't he? I think so. Clean up that whole end of the table if he uh, yes. gets things going his way. Nine ball and the rest of them. Bring some racks together. Oh. 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 How do you miss a shot like that? Well, the difficulty of that shot was his cue ball. A little bit difficult. He should have should have made the shot. But uh, pool is a difficult game even though these guys make it look easy i can assure you that it's a very difficult game anytime you got a club in your hand and you're going solid ball for the magician dito sa rock 11 he's got a bank shot he's banking the two ball he did and he opened things up for himself now just nudged him just perfect Got the six ball right down here in the uh -huh. corner. It's still not an easy rack, though. Nobody's won away from winning the eighth game and the 1995 World Eight Ball Championship. Efren Reyes. 
I don't think the corporate sponsors from around the world uh, really understand how difficult this game is, Jimmy. Or I think you'd see much, much larger purses in this sport than what we've seen so far. Ooh. That's been a whole come and almost scratched it, but didn't. I tell you, the man doesn't make many mistakes. When I see money and things like that going into pro beach volleyball. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> Get a life, will you? I don't know what happened on that shot. He let the, you, you weren't watching that shot. What he wanted doesn't. to do, and that's about the only emotion you see. That's the that's, only time you'll ever yeah, see him smile. Kind of an acknowledgement that you're right. I, well, I goofed it up. He's going to try to bank the four ball. Looks to me he's like he's banking the four ball. Well, he banked the two a while. It, or no, he cut six, the six so he in. Cut the six in the corner. Yeah. Did it get he there? Perfect. He hit it didn't have enough up. speed. Mm. But look what happened. Hey, he doesn't give you much. Even if he gives you a break, he doesn't give you much. <coughs> well, he's got another chance, that's for sure. As long as you get back up to the table, everything's all right. Yeah. Saves him, Tom. If he can win this frame, he can make a match out of this. Sure can. 7 4. Let's see what happened here. He's, he can just bump the eight ball. Just let the cue ball float over. A little high force follow. And just bump the eight ball. Well, that, that looks to me, Jimmy, like uh, the shot to go for here. He's only got one more ball. Well, he got a couple down the table. Mm -hmm. But uh, I don't know. He has a shot here to play this, kiss it off the 14, make it in the corner. I think he's going to try that. But he's worried about position in the next ball. Yeah, he's playing the kiss shot. Good shot. Oh! But where's the position? Well, he doesn't have it, but he's got that ball. If he can make the next shot, he's got a chance with the shot. Yeah. Four and a half by nine foot table is about. 15 by faced with an uphill battle, trailing seven, three. That's a shot he must make. Missed it. Oh! Well, what a question. He hit it too, didn't you? you yeah, well, I had the right line here. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't uh, that easy of an out. I mean, he's got the, the six ball down. He really can't spin it or do anything with it. And soft. Yeah. Wow. Just try to make it in the side pocket. That's about all you can do with a shot. Tom. Eight ball is just sitting there waiting for him, too, if he does. If he can make this ball in the side, the world championship belongs to him. Yeah. No problem for the magician. Going for the eight ball. Efren Batterias. Oh, yeah. Winner, champion for 1995 World 8 Ball Championship, Efren Batarreyes, giniba ang dalawang uh, tirador at pambato ng Amerika. 1995 World 8 Ball Championship, Efren Batarreyes, champion. in the world and he certainly was every bit as good as the great tournament last played well just didn't have enough opportunity and he caught Reyes on a truly picture perfect evening of the salute the new champion they really appreciate great talent and here's another look back boy uh, just a textbook Play. Congratulations to you. Don, go ahead. We'll play. Well, a year ago, we were right here at the Riviera playing the World Nine Ball Championship, and Efren had a tremendous battle against Earl Strickland, and he was at the best pool in the world without a doubt. He went on to win the U.S. Open. He's won two major events on the Pro Tour this year. He's now won the World Eight Ball Championship. He is one of the greatest of all time, ladies and gentlemen. My pleasure, Efren. And now for the check. <laughs> yeah. Great pleasure to present you a check for $15,000. First place check uh, to, uh, to a fellow AMF uh, uh, sponsor, AMF Puyat in the Philippines. Congratulations. <laughs> mm -hmm.
And now, Marty Gross will present him with the cup that he's long sought, his first world championship on the Pro Tour. Efren, uh, uh, this is my third year giving out the trophies here, and we're finally glad to give it to you. You've been working hard now, three years here. And at the Riviera, we're very happy to be again the home of billiards and Efren. Welcome and congratulations. So the third, <laughs> the third time is the charm time. Maraming salamat mo mga kabilis ka sa inyong panonood. Sa mga hindi pa po nakasubscribe sa ating channel na Sardan TV, mag-subscribe na po kayo at uh, press po ang notification bell para ma-update po kayo sa susunod natin mga upload. I-like uh, po ang ating uh, video at i-share po ito. At maraming maraming salamat po at God bless po sa inyong lahat.